everybody and welcome to vlog number 17. I know I lied in saying that number 17 was going to be the last one before winter break, but due to finals and stress about being able to come home to Charlotte, North Carolina was a little more important to take care of than my vlog. And I apologize for lying, but um, I miss you all and I had so much fun over winter break. I miss you all, and I love you all, and I hope you enjoy. So, I'm back in New York after a panic attack or two, but I'm here, and I'm ready to start my new semester and keep working on my craft, because even though the industry that I'm choosing to go into is one of the hardest on the planet, this is what... I was meant to do, this is what I was supposed to do, and this is why I am here. So I'm glad that I got on my plane and I'm glad that I got here. And I've already um, had one class and I have four break right now, and then I go to Meisner and dance class earlier. So I'm really happy. So while I was having my panic attack yesterday and decided that I wasn't going to go back, I was crying, I was. It was bad. I was, br I broke down. I don't know what was wrong. I don't know what triggered it or anything. I was just ready to give up. As but as I was ready to give up, I was wearing this jacket. This jacket right here. And I put my hand, put my hand in the pocket. And well, first I pulled out this admission ticket to ice skating, which did not help at all because I remembered how much fun I was I had with my friends and I didn't want to leave them. That didn't help. <laughs> but then I pulled out one of these. The uh, Operation You're Awesome. I forgot that it was there and I opened it up and I read You're Awesome. And it just... It made me feel better. It made me realize that even though my friends and Charlotte love me and I love them, and even though it's scary living so far away from, from normal, and I had an awesome semester. Fall term was awesome. I learned so much, and why give up now? And I've come so far. I'm a, I'm a new person, I'm a new Kristen, and... So thank you, Joe and Duncan. Because this is the reason I got on my plane. This is the reason I am here, this is the reason I came back. And this is the reason I stopped breaking down. This is the reason I was okay. Thank you. Friends Band C4. Um, of a Sam, Chad, Danny, Dan, Dan, Carter, and Ty Ty. I mean Tyler. He doesn't like when I call him that. Um, I think I talked about C4 during my 14th vlog, and they're just um, my Charlotte friends. And well, I am their biggest fan. Well, you know how I played you the song Creeper last time. Well, they made a new song during break, and you might recognize a little somebody on it. Maybe? Possibly? I'll uh, show you a little snippet. recognize a little somebody's voice in there <laughs> yeah I got to record and it was so so awesome 
I am right now in C4 uh, Studio. Just the, how they hung up was awful. I am so excited. Yeah. I'm nice. C4's biggest fan, and I am in the groundworks <laughs> of a new song. It's right there. Hear it, Dan. And Sam. Is that... <laughs> and other people are coming later. Um, the guitars and things. And the funk. And, the and a trumpet. <laughs> I'm excited. I need to tell you. 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 Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I got to sing, got to see the studio, and got to hang out with my buds, my boys, and it was a good time. You can catch the rest of the song at www.myspace.com slash c4 raps. Oh my god. Avatar was amazing. I saw an IMAX 3D. Sorry, I'm eating. And it was awesome. Oh my gosh. It had action. It had heart. It had love. Oh, it had war. It had everything in it. Everything that you need. And the storyline was awesome. And the CGI. Oh my gosh. The avatars and the people. And I would say more about it, but I'm just so like in awe about the movie. I mean, so many people said it was awesome, so I was like, I hope they don't get my hopes up and then I get crashed, because that happens a lot when people recommend movies. But this movie is amazing. If you have not seen it in 3D or IMAX 3D yet, go see it before it's not in theaters anymore. It's amazing. I just ate paper, though. This was wrapped in this. And it was like under this part. It was like wrapped under this part and I took a bite unknowing. And um, I just ate a piece of paper. Yep. But um, go see Avatar. In IMAX 3D, you really feel like you're in Pandora. You really feel like you're with everybody in the battles, in the heart, in the love. You really feel like you're there and it's just... I don't know how much else to describe it other than amazing. I just, I'm in such awe of this film. Like seriously. Seriously, the director, Titanic and Avatar. I'm speechless. Avatar, go see it. IMAX 3D or 3D. They will both make you feel like you're with the people in the action. Not to mention, the actors are awesome. The acting is amazing. And oh, go see it, please. I just got done with school, and I'm currently on my way back to the dorms at the Clark Street entrance. This is Emily. <laughs> I'm so excited about my circus. I think I'm doing a little better. Confidence building and everything. We have seven new people in our section, and it's really awesome. Good. And uh, we're getting on the elevator right now. Oh, film me, film me, film me, film me, film me. Okay, hold on. That means we have to wait for everyone else to get on. Because I'm being polite. <laughs> It's a nice shot of my bag. <laughs> Get a purse, Christina. <laughs> okay, we're ready? Look, look, look. Oh, I should probably push straight. Yeah, probably. <laughs> you just got Mark's epic failure on camera. No, I, I'm not a failure. I love you, Marky Marky. <laughs> we're on a crowded elevator. You didn't get his reaction shot. My name is Mr. <laughs> Gabaldon. You know. <laughs> I care for you as well, Mrs. McLaughlin. <laughs> you can see. Even though it's spelled it. McLaughlin. It's, it's spelled McLaughlin, but you say McLaughlin. I say McLaughlin. It's yeah, McLaughlin. It's you well, you can't be famous. You can't be famous because someone else already knows that name. Who's calling me? There's a lot of people have that name. There's a turn Oh, I think it's a more. I was so confused. We're telling everyone to go to Clark class. Oh, okay. oh. Clark! Clark! That's not me. So that sign over there says, New Year's resolution, get fat. Take it, it's a lottery um, thing, but if that was just that first part, I think that's something. a sign. I think it's trying to tell me something. Trying to tell me something. That I should start eating more than I normally do, and I don't like that very much. 
go. Don't let them explode. Watch them grow. Oh, they, they went down again. That's cool. <laughs> Are they getting really big? Don't stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Should we check? Marshall. Let's check that. Yeah, check the chocolate a lot. You have to pull it. You have to push it and pull it at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> Can you do one of those? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like letting you do everything yourself. Look at they stay permanently enlarged at some point. Oh my God, they're they're ready. They're Our beautiful. s'mores are ready. Our s'mores are ready. That was vlog number seventeen. I hope you enjoyed, and I love you, and I miss you. And this is Kristen's Super Short Show.